In America, people want to know how to make money, so they have the right to read a book on how to make money. In America, people want to get a job, so they have the right to read books and go to seminars and go to groups like they have outside my old city to learn how to get a job. The crazy thing about some of those groups are the people that are leading it are volunteers and haven't had jobs in years, and yet they stay abreast of what's going on by talking as non-for-profit volunteers and sometimes paid volunteers, if that makes sense, to the leaders of that community who either tell them the truth or lie to them about what it takes to get jobs because most of the people they're talking to are people who lead entrepreneurs and not every business that can employ them and afford them are in that room. Does that make sense to you? But sometimes we have these marvelous organizations that don't do the job. But at the same time, what I can say to you is if you want to learn how to make cash, then you read a book on how to make cash. But let's talk about this. You're jealous of a man who knows how to make a living at $350 an hour or $50 an hour while you're still living at between $12 and $20 an hour. So how do you help him? Do you piss all over him or do you go up and talk to him about your hopes, your dreams, your goals and ask his advice on what you could do to change your life? But don't waste his time if you're not willing to do the work. You see, true earning is done in work. True earning is done in discipline. True earning is not behaving like an asshole and jerk and an illegal person thinking you're going to get away with what you've done that's totally illegal.